I am placed this just right, like so. Ready, guys? Food of life, such a beautiful thing. Don't you think? If you guys are doing this content, don't forget to like this content here. Also, click on the bell. Come on, be a part of the notification. Dang! <laughs> Where are the weed smokers at? <laughs> yes, guys, I know it's been a while since, what? What was it, a month after? Guys, I apologize, guys. This is dedicated to you, all right? This video is dedicated to you. Wait to the end, and you'll see what's for dessert. Don't blink! I know you guys have been waiting patiently for this, and I wanna say, I wanna thank you guys for being patient with me, all right? Okay. We're just gonna put a bunch of random things that I feel like would be good for munchies. So, two boiling pot of water. I got some fusilini noodles or pasta. I'm just gonna dump in. Over here, got some corn. I'm just gonna dump in. And we're gonna make some elotes. We got two tablespoons of oil. We got some onions here. Get this yellowish garlic here. Don't worry guys, it's still good. Just a little teaspoon. I'm not even sure what I'm thinking right now, guys. I'm gonna switch this into a plate pot here. Okay. Alright, once I got it cooked down, two pounds of ground beef here. Two seasoned, half a tablespoon of salt, half a teaspoon of oregano, half a tablespoon of black pepper, teaspoon onion powder, teaspoon white pepper, teaspoon dry thyme. Lastly, tablespoon of paprika. Put this in. Get that nice and cooked. I'm gonna drain some of this fat out. I'm gonna throw half of this portion back in. We got tomato sauce here. We got some of the pasta that we cooked. Right in there. Mix this in. If your parents made you this when you were young, you're a chill person today, guys. Legit. Got some mozzarella cheese here. Just a tad. Legit is my childhood right here. Best part, your mom packing this for lunch for you. What a bonus. <laughs> All right, set this aside. Cheese dandruff. Closer. Just get up on air. A little parsley. That's it. Next dish. Oop. Corn is cooling off right now, guys. But first, let's do some mushroom caps. Mozzarella mushroom caps to be exact. So, a little olive oil. All around. Put some in there. I got some of this. Best thing ever. Johnny's garlic spread. Just gonna sprinkle it all around as well. Okay. Place them in formation. All together. Which I'm just gonna rip apart. Stuff it in. Rip apart. Stuff it in. Oven's preheating. Toss it in for about 10 minutes at 420. Hey, 420, eh? <laughs> I have munchies without good old buffalo hot wings. So I got two pounds of wings here. A tablespoon of seasoning salt. I'm using cool and runnings. Put that in. Everybody into the pool. Put the cap for this. Eight to 10 minutes.
insert this one. In low days, get a paintbrush, mayonnaise. Paint it on. Parmesan cheese. I did have some tahini, but I goofed it guys. It's rotten, not rotten, it's expired. I never knew tahini expires, so next best thing, hot chili powder. Okay, everybody cool with that? There it is guys, this is my ultimate Munchies feast. So we got elotes. We got stuffed mushroom. We got the classic What is this? I don't know what's called my childhood favorite <laughs> Buffalo chicken wings with some blue ranch. Some of you guys be like Quan. That's it. Give me a second. I can't believe you guys complaining You know what? I can't believe you guys. I got you guys. Give me a second. I am placed this just right like so Ready guys All right this, my friend, is your ultimate right here. Munchy feast. Let me go in again. Buffalo wings with blue cheese. My childhood favorite pasta. Stuffed mushrooms. Elotes. Dessert cabinet. Ketchup chips. Big shout out to all the Canadians who love ketchup Down chips. Down to the candy section. We got Twix. Healthy snacks in the middle or at the back. <laughs> We got Reese's here, Kit Kats, Galsits, Galsits, or peanut butter covered chocolate. We got my favorite Rice crispy Treats, Crispers, all dressing, barbecue. This is my favorite right here. Fruit Gushers right here. This stuff is legit right here. Even when you're a kid, even when you're older now, this is still the bomb right here. We got, what is that? Ah, Twinkies in the back. Cookies. We got gay bacon strips. <laughs> or just... Uh, bacon strip, not bacon strip, what the epic, epic meal time just ruined my mind. What is this, airheads or sour airheads? We got sour keys, we got some bubblegum cola. We got some regular colas down here too, guys. We got some peak freams. We got these sesame crackers here, or sesame snaps. Almonds, and it's all here. Let's do this, so, where should we begin? Who has the munchies? <laughs> if y'all got the munchies, just come on through, okay? Just come on through, okay? I'm gonna start first off with the appetizer. So the appetizer, stuffed mushrooms. Look at this. You see it? Nice, simple, and easy. Nice. Bite on this. Quick tap. Stuffed mushrooms. That's got it. Nice. Super for this. Mmm. I'll explain this later, alright? I always wanted one of this when I was a kid. Why? Do you guys remember the show MTV Cribs? Mm. 
Bow Wow edition. Chicken wings. Quick cut. Let's get it. Nice. Sweet pop this. Mm-hmm. This is pretty ultimate already. But with this, <laughs> ever since I was young, I always dreamt about having a candy store in the house. After MTV Cribs, you guys remember Lil Bow Wow? You guys can search it up, he probably still has that. Episode of it. MTV Cribs, Lil Bow Wow show us around the studio. But out of nowhere, uh, he showed us the studio. And after he went to the vending machine in this studio, and he was like, I don't pay for this. Then he went to the back room. And then he showed us this beautiful room of just stack of candy and chips. Ever since then, I always dreamt to have them. Now I have a mini one. <laughs> this was his childhood right here. Hmm. El Lotes. Big shout out Mexico. Hmm? It's got well, there's some chulu out here. I did have some tahini, like I said before, guys, but it expired in 2017, so I'm not even sure why I still had it. But I never knew tahini expires, guys. It's got nice, super powerful. Mm. That's cracked, my friend. <laughs> Mexico. Mm. This is beyond crack, my friends. I said there's no clean way of eating a lot this. You just go for it. I think that's the best way. You can always wash it off the Okay, these stuffed mushrooms. So simple and good. So deadly and good actually. Another one. Quick tap. Nice. Super. Nice. Mm -hmm. I forgot to say, guys. I personally don't smoke, but I do got the munchies all the time. <laughs> I know my eyes always looks like I do. But that's just the Asian in me, all right? <laughs> Sometimes I giggle. Or a lot of times I do giggle. It's just because I like to laugh at my own jokes. <laughs> I know a lot of you guys want me to cut to the chase and get to the candy already, but here it is, guys. Take a look at my stockpile of goodies or munchies here. You can only pick three out of this whole thing. What is your choice? My choice, Kit Kat. 
Rice Krispie, of course. And a sesame stack. Only three, right? What are your three? You know what? Let's go four. <laughs> what are your three? You can only pick three, guys. Write down in the comment section there. Oh yeah, for you health junkies out there, I got some snap peas in the back there if you guys want something, some popcorn. Get on it. Did I get a Gushers? Oh, I didn't get Gushers? You know what? Two, four, five. Let's do five. All right. <laughs> this is my three. <laughs> you can only pick three, okay? This is why I'm feeling three right now, okay? And we got water, and I know your guys' mouth is a little pasty right now, guys. Sip of this. Got it? <laughs> you know your mouth is pasty right now. After all that, you know what I'm saying? Okay. First snack, or first munchie, Gushers. I don't care what you guys say. Gushers, legit, the best thing ever. Guys, open your mouth. Or if you guys don't know what Gushers is, it's pretty much a fruit snack. No, fruit snack with fruit fruit juices in there. And you pretty much just pop it in your mouth and let it burst in your mouth. Let's get it. Nice. Let's pop this. Wow. No. Hmm? I remember I had a friend. My mom would never buy me this ever when I was young. My friend had the best lunch ever. His mom always packed him fruit gushers. What was that? What is that stuff called? A snack pack? Where you just build your own pizza and build your own what, little sandwiches? Fruit gushers, this, and a juice box. And fruit. Meat, rice, and fish. <laughs> Sometimes uh, vegetables too, guys. Okay, next one. You know Kit Kat's the best. No, all three of these guys. Kid you not. One, two, three. Three of my best chocolate bars are there. Kit Kat, Reese, and Twix. What is this? Kit Kat, it's all about sharing. There it is, guys. I guess you don't want it. Okay. But what? What thing I was gonna say? What bugs me the most? I don't know why. I know a lot of my a lot of people hate me when I smack, like when I eat. What what bugs me the most is watching people eat and they just you know get some sting on their hand. They just like they just like suck on it, like they suck hard on it, like it's kind of weird in a way for me which I don't really enjoy but that's what triggers me <laughs> okay next ketchup chips if you guys never had ketchup chips before you guys must try ketchup chips I don't say it's better than barbecue chips or barbecue flavored chips you guys buy this quick time it's got a nice soup it's a Canadian classic ketchup chips Absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Okay. Next favorite snack. Sesame snaps. This for some reason. Ooh. <laughs> this for some reason, back in the day, went to the candy store and never bought this. Why? It just didn't look appealing to me. By looks of it versus like candy and gummies. This did not look appealing to me. When I got older, bought it, tried it, fell in love. Quick time. We got a nice soup off this. Mm. Tastes like a brick of sesame seeds with a nice sugar coating on it. Mm hmm. I personally don't like eating this out and about. I like laying in my bed and just nibbling at it. <laughs> like, that was really fast. I, I never do it like that. 
Like I nibble at it. Like bites and bites. Okay. Next, childhood favorite. Rice Krispie Treat. You know what's better than a Rice Krispie Treat? A wheat puff, a chocolate wheat puff. You guys, a bite of this. Look at that. It's got it nice. I haven't found chocolate wheat puff in a while. I'm not even sure where to find it, guys. If you guys know what chocolate wheat puff is, please guide me the way of finding it. It's pretty much like this, but chocolate form, but as like wheat puffs. You guys know what I'm saying? What is it called? Chocolate wheat puff squares? I don't know. That's so awesome. It tastes exactly like I imagined it when I was young. All right. I got lots of food up there. A whole cover of snacks. I got a nice comfy couch. Turn on the TV. Watch some Netflix. Please take off your shoes. Water in the back as well. All right. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Peace out.